On a corner of the Puck building sits a plump, gilded statue of the structure's namesake. Puck, from Shakespeare's A Midsummer Night's Dream, is the mascot of one of New York's best-known humor magazines in its day, Puck Magazine. The magazine, a joint venture between illustrator Joseph Kepler and printer Adolf Schwarzmann, launched in 1876 as a German-language periodical. Its quick success gave birth to an English-language iteration within a year. Puck's topical jabs and brutal satires wanted booming circulation, which in turn allowed for the construction of the Puck building. Albert Wagner, a German-born architect, designed this building, which was built on the fringes of the era's main publishing district. It was completed in 1885, and the magazine's continued success prompted a further expansion in 1892. Inventive architectural thinking saved the Puck Building from possible demolition near the turn of the century, when a planned extension of Lafayette Street threatened to cut right through its address. By trimming off about a third of the building and constructing a new western facade, the structure and its chubby mascot were preserved for future generations. Puck Magazine was eventually purchased by a frequent subject of its satire, publishing magnate and Citizen Kane source material, William Randolph Hearst. Shortly after purchase, Hearst changed the magazine into a monthly publication and then shut the magazine down altogether in 1918. In recent years, the building has been used for other graphic design and publishing ventures, commercial and retail space. Both Pratt Institute and NYU rented space in the Puck building. The building has also been used as the backdrop for movies and television shows, such as When Harry Met Sally and Will and & Grace.